Hello everyone, Red's up here. Welcome back to another Ready or Not video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to play with mods in Ready or Not. But before we go into the video, please, if you're new here, make sure to subscribe for more videos like this. The first step that you need to do is open up your Google. After you open up your Google, you're going to type Nexus Mods, which you see already here I have it. The first thing that comes out, you're going to press on it. Go into Nexus Mod, uh, Mods website. If you don't have an account, you have to uh, first create one and then install mods for any other game that you want. If you have it already, just go and find Ready or Not. You're going to go here and this is the area uh, where you can find specific mods only for Ready or Not. Then just simply go to one of these sections, either popular, all or popular 30 uh, days or more trending or updated versions of the mods. After that, simply find the mod that you're looking for. For example, this is the best mod yet, in my opinion. So just go to it, go to file section, find the mod that you want. This is the basic one. So you're gonna hit download, manual download, and then you're gonna uh, slow down to, uh, download that mod for yourself. And then it should be downloaded into your uh, downloads section of your PC. After that, just simply find other mods that you would like to have in the game and then you should be okay. Just close this, that's the first step done. Second step, just open up your this PC, go to your download section and here you can see I already have mods here ready to go. When you download the uh, mod for first time, it's gonna be not extracted, so you have to extract the folder itself until you can use the uh, the mod inside the folder. So you're gonna right click on the mod that you have and then you should say uh, extract files here or extract all files. After you have extracted the files, uh, the folder, sorry, uh, it should look something like this, very clean uh, folder icon. You're gonna go into it and then you can literally see there is only one pack file all the time in most of the mods that are made for ready or not you can literally see there's only one pack file so we're gonna go to whatever we want just leave that there then the third step open up a second window and find your games directory for for me basically it's gonna be in a uh, e sorry e uh, steam steam apps common and then ready or not from here it's also simple Go to ready or not again, content, packs, and this is the area where you should uh, put your mods in. So we're gonna go back to the same window we were before, which is our mod. We're gonna take our mod, left click on it once, and then right click, either copy, or you can literally just uh, drag this over here and then drop it in. And it should say either replace or it's gonna either way place it there for you if you haven't installed any mods yet. And that's basically it. You can literally download mods like this every time that you install, uh, that you want to install a mod into your ready or not. Basically, if you run into troubles uh, running the game after you just uh, recently downloaded some mods into your game, uh, if you have problems, you can just uh, come back to your directory of the game ready or not content packs go all the way down until you found the name of the mod that you just downloaded recently and if it's causing you trouble you can just right click and then delete it and it should uh, fix your issue if you just want to uh, pick a specific mod that you don't want to use anymore you can just come here right click and then delete it from here and it should be okay that's literally it to install these mods. Now let's get into the game and see if it's working. All right, when you're in the game, just literally go to any lockers that you have to see if your mods are working. So we're gonna go in here and then we're gonna go into guns, whatever gun mod that we, uh, that we have installed, which is uh, the Noviski I installed recently. Uh, we can literally see it's already working. I also installed a uh, sight for my gun, 
which is Aimpoint uh, a uh, Pro. It's already working, as you can see. We can go to any other guns that you uh, want to see if it's working. So I basically have this gun also. Uh, it's working. Uh, what else? We have Mark 16, which I installed SCAR for it. Uh, it's already working. Uh, the other stuff that you can find is the gloves I installed. The, go uh, the gloves that I installed, it's also working. So it's really good to go. Uh, there is nothing much to it. The mods are working. If, like I said, you're running into trouble uh, installing them, just uh, go back to the same exact pathway I did and it should uh, work fine. So yeah, that's for the tutorial. I hope you guys liked this video. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And I see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.